So all of these chicken doors pretty much do the same thing, but let me tell you something, not all chicken doors are created equal. I'm gonna tell you what, this is probably one of the heaviest chicken doors that I've had an opportunity to review. This one was sent to me at no charge so that I could review it and just right off the bat, this is probably one of the most sturdy doors that I have had a chance to lay my hands on. I mean, a lot of these are kind of uh, lightweight and flimsy and you gotta be careful about uh, installing these and bending the frame, but this this thing is solid, it's really solid. So you get a good solid door and then there's your, your power to your door and uh, you also get a solar panel for the power. They also do give you 110 power if you wanna go that route. And then you also got this control panel. Now this is different than some of the other ones that I've had a chance to install. Some of them are installed right in the door. Others are just right on top of the door. This is a complete unit itself and it's a solid unit as well. And first thing you're going to want to do is take the back off and install three of your AA batteries. And once you get that installed, then you put that back plate back on and then we can set this and program this. Okay, so this is our control unit right here. On the bottom side are your buttons to, uh, to set that and to open and close your door manually if you needed to do so. Uh, you'll also see an input right here. This is gonna be from your solar panel. That's gonna be your power. And then you got an output right here, which is gonna go to your door, which is gonna raise it and lower it. Okay, so the first thing we wanna do is set the time and it is currently 1.08 p.m. Now this is always gonna be on the 24 hour time. So it's gonna be 13. Now, to open our door, we wanted to open up at 6 in the morning, so we're going to push this down button right here, and then we want it to close at, that would be 6 p.m., I want it to go to 21. So once you get everything installed, you want to make sure that your door is going to close fine, you don't have any bows or any pinches, remember I told you that if you if you suck that frame in too far, you get a bow, then your door is not going to work correctly. I went ahead and left my motor, my motor timer at the default timer of 20 seconds, 23 seconds. And now that everything's working as it should, uh, we're gonna go ahead and see if we can't uh, catch some chickens coming in and out of the, 